In order to teach you technology, the fact is, we cannot teach it simply by having you listen to lectures. The only way that you can really understand technology is if you try to build it. This is how you develop the skills to be technology leaders and have positive impact in a world that is always going to be uncertain. So I had no knowledge on how to create any app or any codes, but I think the teacher gave us sufficient tools for us, even with no knowledge, to just pick up this website and create an app from zero without knowing how to use technology. I could see how in session one they were very skeptical. They, for the most part, they didn't know anything about technology or they thought they didn't know anything about technology. However, very quickly I could see first how they came up with very interesting ideas. One important point of this innovation engineering framework is that you do not need to be a coder, you, don't need, you do not need to be an expert in technology to really build technology. Right? You can do so in a step-by-step -step fashion and still be successful and, and learning along the way, of course. I think there's something very particular about this course, which is um, we're trying to involve the students uh, in, in you know, making something. Um, we opted for a methodology where it's more of, you know, here are the tools, um, you know, go investigate, go build something with this. You know, small but important kind of uh, failures is what they learn most out of. Um, and so I think that's what they're, what they're taking away is you know, very critical you know, decision-making processes that they're responsible for. Even if you feel that it's not related to your career, for example, me as a communication student, in the end, it's like super important that you have the knowledge and you take that class because it's how the world now is built. And this is like the future of our generation.